Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. So, due to popular demand, I'm back with another vlog. I'm loving vlogs right now, so I hope you guys are too. But yeah, so since it's almost 2022, I was actually thinking about like doing things to make 2022 more organized. I think uh, a lot of people want that, so yeah, I thought I could share what I'm gonna do myself with you guys if you can get some ideas or inspiration. I usually watch these vlogs to relax and just get motivated. Today I'm actually wearing something very comfy because um, today is gonna be very slow. I'm actually going to take things very easy because I don't want to like put too much pressure on myself like I usually do before the new year. But yeah, so I'm wearing my uh, Animal Crossing, wait, my Animal Crossing sweater and I have my pleated skirt, really comfortable right now. I actually bought um, an icon pack because if you guys didn't watch my last video I started a small business and I'm selling icon packs if you want to check it out. While looking for inspiration I found this seller on Etsy and they make the cutest icons ever. It's like pixel theme and I really liked that uh, red and pink pack so I got it. Just sit back with a nice cup of coffee or tea or whatever you want and yeah let's just take this nice and easy and slowly get into the new year
so I just wanted to pop by, pop by? I don't know, I just wanted to come by and like show you what I did the previous days, so I literally worked like maybe five hours on this. <laughs> I redid my whole Notion page and I actually handle Notion pretty well now. Uh, it's just that it takes me so long to find accurate pictures because I want the theme to just stick together, you know what I mean? I just want everything to look good together. So I'm going to show you in a bit uh, what I did. Um, so far this vlog is kind of like very simple, I feel like, but as I said in the beginning of the vlog, I just want it to be very like calming. I'm just going to cut this and show you in a minute. So before we start, I just wanted to show you this website that I just discovered. I'm trying it and for now I kind of like it. It's very nice to organize all your websites like in one place and you can organize them like I did this. So if I want to journal, I have journaling. Oh wait, that's too personal. <laughs> if I want to check out my shop, it's here. Um, anyways, it's not sponsored, but I discovered it and I thought it was really nice to organize everything. And I thought, why not start the new year organized like... So then we go to my Notion. So this is my new template. Well, uh, I don't know if I'm going to make a template out of it. Let me know guys in the comments if you want it as a template, but uh, yeah, so is it recording? Okay, it is. Is it though? Yes, it is. Uh, that's how it looks. I'm going with a pixel theme. I don't know why these days I'm really feeling the pixel uh, aesthetic. I just really love it. I've always loved pixel aesthetic, but um, like right now it's just more than ever I feel like. So first we go to planning and that's where I decided to put all of my planning basically so um it's gonna be like my schedule so as you can see i wrote down my schedule and i made it like pink and uh green and it just like it looks like a matcha strawberry matcha thingy it's just really nice i like it and then here i have my to-do list that i'm going to blur and here i have a week or weekly maybe weekly is better so i have the whole week spread out like this and i have the calendar so i can keep track on the events and things. I don't put my uh, filming schedule here because I really have a whole other place, a whole other website uh, to do this because it's much easier, it's much more like you can add colors and I think it's really helpful to see which days are filming days, which days are editing days and when I have to upload the video. Now let's go to library and this one I'm actually really happy with. Look at this, I'm going to try to put uh, the artist's name in the description as I did for the last Notion video because I like to give credit please give credit. I really like this art. Uh, so the library is basically where I keep track on uh, my movies, my books, um, animes. I have I actually have like um, another website for tracking the animes I watched um, but it's just like my reading list. Media is going to be for movies and series and podcasts um, and then I decided to include this little recommendation page because people keep recommending me things and I'm always like uh, writing them on notes on my iPhone and it's just so messy and I really wanted to have like this separate um, page. Then let's go back to journals and this one is actually for all my journals as if I was just keeping them like this. You know how I keep my journals like stacked uh, on top of each other and each of them has like a purpose. Um, well, it's the same thing, but it's digital, so I love the art. <laughs> uh, don't mind this, it's just that it's new, it's gonna be my gratitude journal because it's a goal of mine to write down gratitude uh, every day, so I still have to edit this, but basically I have my basic journal, uh, then I have my dream journal because I like to write down my dreams, then I have uh, ideas and this is going to replace this. I use this uh, journal that my friend gifted me to write down my YouTube uh, and literally any idea I have. And then, um, this is personal, so I'm obviously not gonna click on it, but that's basically where I keep, um, I think there was something I was doing, like a project of mine, 
uh, so it's in there. And there's also another project of mine. I, I should have named it project, like personal projects, please don't click. So that's my Notion tour, it's very quick, um, very simple, because I wanted something simple to use, you know. Alright, so that was pretty much it for today's vlog. Um, we still have some time, so I think I'm gonna add some things, like some advice. Like I said earlier, uh, it's really about just entering the new year with like new goals and just with a high spirit and like a positive mindset but it's not about like starting new like you can obviously start thinking like okay from now on i'm gonna do this and this and this but it's not just about like forget everything that passed the year before because i feel like the experiences we had bad or good are what make us uh what we are now so if you erase that you just you just erase the lessons you learned last year and that's very like it's a shame you know you got through all this to just give up on it i think it's a shame obviously all the experiences are different um and you do you do you basically if you want to just start the new year and think you're a new person go ahead just do what makes you happy but yeah i hope you liked this little vlog i will see you not next week and not the week after because i am going away for some time and yeah i'll keep you updated on my instagram but take it easy and enjoy the process and it's all gonna be okay and yeah i'll see you very soon please take care bye